A recent rape arrest has neighbors and police on high alert. Detectives believe their suspect may be connected to other cases. And as News 4's Dominique Moody shows us, people who live in Olney are worried about their kids' safety. I mean, we have two little kids, you know, six and two, and just the fact that it happened so close to home, it really was alarming. Rachel Fisher describing the moments after she found out a young girl was sexually assaulted on the very street she walks with her two children. That really hit close to home, you know, because we have a daughter and um, it was just really scary. Detectives quickly identified Joshua Black as the suspect and later arrested him at his home. News 4 discovered this wasn't the first time he's had a run in with the law. Black has faced indecent exposure, stalking and trespassing charges in the past. One of the most recent cases happening in April of last year at the University of Maryland, where Black was arrested for second degree assault. Now, there are a fair number of kids in this area and it's pretty densely, it's, it's a lot of walking community. And so given the circumstances of, of, of this sexual assault, it was not surprising that someone, that, that the victim was essentially uh, a young person walking a dog. That is a very common activity. It's a, it's a, it's a very walkable neighborhood. Dr. Earl Stoddard is a only resident in Montgomery County's assistant chief administrative officer. He says the neighborhood became familiar with Black back in May. Stoddard claims Black was caught masturbating under a towel in front of some teenagers at a neighborhood pool, including Stoddard's 13-year-old daughter, but Black wasn't charged with a crime. Everyone feels like this was a this was preventable in the sense that we could see it coming, but obviously the law doesn't consider all these things. As for the Fisher family in the future? She's only six. We don't let her walk by herself yet. But um, yeah, I mean, even walking with her, I mean, I feel like I'm going to be more on alert these days. Investigators say they are concerned that there could be more victims that were sexually assaulted by Black and are asking all victims to come forward. In Olney, Dominique Moody, News 4. Tonight, you could have information that helps detectives in Virginia crack a sex assault case.